normally when we, we do blogging, we don't write that fast when we are speaking because it could be dangerous. So on average, it's around 70 km per hour or 60 km per hour, 60 to 70 km per hour. Good morning, YouTube. I've been using GoPros for a very long time. My first GoPro is the Hero 3. That's the legendary Hero 3. Still working, but as finicky as usual. Then I bought the Hero 9 because of the front screen and a very good um, stabilization. Unfortunately, GoPro have suffered from day one the legendary freezing and overheating. It have a microphone input which is for Hero 3 it's just a USB uh, micro USB it's not micro USB it's a mini USB to 3.5 which uh, is quite expensive for, for just a cable it is an original uh, GoPro and the audio is good but this camera suffer freeze overheating the battery will not last that long and also there's no stabilization so then I decided to get after a long time I'm using SJ cam uh, some other camera from other manufacturers then I decided to buy the GoPro Hero 9. The Hero 9 is good. Stabilization is perfect. You can do live streaming. You have a, a media mod for it, but I use uh, this USB C connector dongle for the audio adapter and it still suffer the same problem it freeze and overheat the original battery bulge so i've thrown away the original battery bought a few more other batteries i bought a second original battery is bulge so a bit fed up with this i suffer overheating and occasionally it freeze on me so it's frustration frustrated to have a camera that is not reliable and this audio adapter uh, is either the camera or the adapter fail but I suspect the camera fail and I do not I do not no longer can do external audio because this doesn't work anymore uh, the camera was still under warranty but unfortunately for the local supplier in Malaysia they have closed shop so I would not, I'm not able to claim warranty on this camera even though I still have warranty at the time. So that's it. Uh, with all the problems with GoPros, I decide to move on to something else. So off with the GoPro, I decide to go for finally for the DJI Action 3. This DJI Action 3, I'm a bit hesitant to buy the DJI. Uh, the, the original Osmo Action was not that good and the audio is not that good then they come up with the Action 2 which is ridiculous to me in its design and finally they come up with the Action 3 this is acceptable then I look at YouTube there's a lot of uh, review saying that it's very good and the audio interface is reasonably priced then I decide to buy this Osmo Asian 3 and use it and this camera so far from the review uh, it's been good and there's no overheating issues and the battery the extreme battery lasts a long time uh, more than two hours that's good for me that do multiple cycle uh, blogging and for the audio okay uh, I've tried various uh, methods to put audio into this camera so I have this OTG cable OTG cable 
made by Ugreen OTG cable for actually for my iPad because I want to use uh, to transfer file for my iPad so I use this OTG cable with Ugreen uh, USB sound card so the setup is quite simple I use uh, this OTG cable plug it into the Osmo and I plug in the sound card that's it that's all is required then I can use a microphone to have audio so that's the setup that I have so but this is a TRRS microphone because of the U, U green is using a TRRS right then that's the setup that I use and it works and I can also use root wireless go with it so root wireless go will work and all I need is to have the TRS to TRRS cable then it will work with root wireless go goes into here but this is a bit uh, too big and it's also um, having additional items and Ugreen made uh, USB-C to 3.5 millimeter audio jack with DAC that can be used but I did not buy it yet I was uh, trying to get it my hand on it but that should works because anything that works with the iPad will work with DJI Osmo Action 3 so the benchmark is anything that work with iPad for audio input it will work then I have lying around with, with me a microphone a USB microphone it's cheap USB microphone I bought it about four years ago for my SJ cam but it doesn't work with the SJ cam it's been lying around in the drawer for such a long time this is a very cheap microphone cost about five US dollar each and the model number is uh, JH-042 and uh, level layer microphone type C and I've tested it it works very well and all I need is the microphone I wire up inside my helmet it's a standard wireless uh, level layer but I put a dead cat uh, at the end of all my microphone I will put a dead cat so that uh, it will reduce the weed noise then the microphone will go into the DJI straight away it's a very simple uh, setup and let's switch it on I put the gain to um, uh, plus 3 because the default is plus 20 it's a bit too hot for this microphone so let's plug it in properly okay see the microphone symbol and I put it in the left cheek I usually put the microphone in the left cheek you can see when I it works and I can select microphone it come out again I will only set it to 3 dB plus 3 dB because the microphone is a bit too hot some microphone you can have it to all the way to 20 but most of the microphone I reduce it so let's uh, go and have a ride and this is one of the easiest cheapest uh, to me um, the setup because the microphone only cost about five us dollar each uh, just got myself this usb-c to headphone jack from apple this is actually for uh, the ipad and tiny little dongle USB-C and this is a TRRS uh, audio adapter to support microphone internally it has uh, DAC chips that will do wonderful and the frequency response is flat so it doesn't alter any uh, things and this one works very well and if you do not know what to get just get the Apple, Apple connector 
and let's see uh, we have been use it with this is a Sony hands-free kit which I have removed the earpiece only the microphone and this is a TRRS a lot of people are com confused between TRRS and TRS anyway this is a TRRS tip ring ring sleeve and this is the TRS tip ring sleeve so this normally uh, this is what you call a stereo mic and this is a headset mic which have um, left right uh, audio for the speakers and the microphone input okay, that's that's the one part that a lot of people get confused so this is another TRRS microphone which we can I can use very well so just use one of this phone so this this microphone I have uh, installed earlier to this uh, all right let's do it and this phone and let's switch on the camera let's have a look okay camera you can see the microphone um, icon is there testing one two three four testing one two three four i already uh, set the gain to about 14 so gain about 14 once you have this page you know that you your microphone is successfully connected because without a microphone, you will not get to this page. So that is uh, one thing. So testing one, two, three, four. No, no problem with this. Testing one, two, three, four. It's a bit hot uh, right now. Uh, on the once you get the read uh, on the microphone, it is showing actually uh, uh, clipping. So uh, when you adjust the microphone gain make sure you reduce it until you do not see the the rate uh, coming out but for motor blogging it's best to install it in the helmet then adjust it in the, within the helmet then uh, make it as a preset hey that's that works fine if if i pull out this microphone the okay there's nothing but you still have the microphone symbol let's put the sony microphone yes sony microphone it still works i have not adjusted this yet so testing one two three four testing so it's clipping so i have to adjust the again so no problem if you have a trs microphone if if you have a trs microphone like this and you want to use it here it will not work but you can easily get an adapter which uh, uh, split the output between the microphone and uh, head, uh, head headphone put an adapter here and plug in the TRS microphone at this end then you can use the TRS microphone as you can see show here testing one two three four Testing one two three four. Testing one two three four. So the the microphone symbol is there when you hit the microphone is there. So that's all. There's nothing difficult about connecting microphone to a DJI cam, and you can use even Rode Wireless Go, and Rode Wireless Go is much better because here is Rode Wireless Go and all you need to do is get the TRS to TRRS connector like this uh, the TRRS will be here and the output from the root wireless go is the TRS connect it here switch it on I have not adjusted the TRS so it should be very hot so switch this on okay the camera the, 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 the thing is on now let's see Roots Wireless Go. You can see I am tapping the microphone, tapping the microphone, and you can see at the microphone and the camera is response to talking. So I did not adjust this one yet. This is probably very hot. 
testing one two three four hello testing one two three four you can see the response so there's no big deal connecting anything to the dji or small tree it's just that people will be confused because the one thing is the adapter some with a dac chip some without dac chips so make sure you get the one with dac chip and support microphone because some uh, adapter will have a dac chip but it's only for the speakers it does not support the head the microphone so that's all so make sure it fully support uh, microphone and uh, speakers so then you will not have any problem and another thing is people will get confused because of the this connector here will need to use trrs and you have to use the tip ring ring sleeve kind of connector which is those that come with your hands-free kit uh, that is for your mobile phone a lot of people get confused because now they will start to plug in the trs then uh, again they are confused because the adapter is non-dac or the adapter is sometimes uh, dac but does not support microphone so they get confused with all these things so please there's nothing difficult about it just understand the electronics involved okay continue with your video bye bye it's a test of osmo action 3 with a usb c microphone uh, for moto logging okay let's go uh, shield is open so you can do a very short ride Okay, now the shield is closed and we'll see. Uh, I got to try various speed, but I will not go that fast. Most probably it will go up to 90 km per hour. Yeah, audio test. This uh, USB C, I bought it about four years ago because I was testing the SJ cam and it's been laying down laying in my drawer for a long long time so I managed to locate it and testing it out the speed now around 52 km per hour indicated and hopefully the wind noise is not interrupting the audio the microphone I put it at the inside the uh, left cheek, uh, sorry, the right cheek, cheek pad, underneath the right cheek pad. Usually that's where I put the uh, microphone as close as possible to my ears because whatever I hear uh, should be going into the uh, microphone. Now the speed is 72 km per hour. I am using an open face uh, helmet, the GV Scudo. I, I will usually ride with open face helmet because uh, I do not use uh, full face uh, that much. I do have full face, but I do not use it that much. So let's test this this stretch of road. I can go a bit fast because there's no traffic at all. Just a uh, good thing, uh, speed. 78, 85, 89, 90, 93 km per hour. 100 km per hour. Testing 1, 2, 3, 4. Hello, testing 1, 2, 3, 4. This should be very noisy now. 106. I just want to go for 110. That's about the speed limit. 110 km per hour. Indicator. So that's about okay, the speed should be okay with the speed. Slow down because of the long ball, I have to double back. Normally when we, we do blogging, we don't write that fast when we are speaking because it could be dangerous. So on average it's around 70 km per hour or 60 km per hour, 60 to 70 km per hour. That's good enough, uh, but when we are driving at the, at the highway, uh, probably slightly faster. 
uh, uh, wind noise will be more. So this is, uh, I'm going to maintain around 80 km per hour. This is 80 km per hour and I'm speaking uh, into the level air microphone and I'm going to test it out. Uh, this, testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. Hopefully it's good. Otherwise, I'm going to find another solution and probably going to use the uh, USB-C dongle with uh, one of the more expensive microphones because uh, microphones play a very important role in uh, noise reduction. Testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. Hello, testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. This microphone you can buy from China, uh, probably it costs about five dollar US each. Testing one, two, three, four. Because it's very cheap. So I'm quite skeptical how it's going to sound like. I'm, I do not have much faith in this uh, microphone because it's such a cheap microphone. But if it can uh, do low speed, then it should be okay. Testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. Even the more expensive microphone fail when we are doing a uh, high speed. So it's very difficult to find a good uh, solution to make sure the audio is good. Okay, YouTube, uh, I'm going to cut the video at this current now over here. Thank you very much.